What's up, curl friends? Welcome back to the channel. It's Elena. If you're new around here, welcome. Welcome to my channel. And to in today's video, I'm gonna be using some items from my stash. Okay, y'all. I'm still trying to get through that little section. Y'all remember that whole section that I did where I had said I needed to go through these products and I was trying to get rid of them in the fall and winter months. Well. I'm still trying to use up the stash as well as use a couple of new things in between. So today I'm going to be using or trying to use up the rest of this lot of body um, moisture moisturize me curl and style milk. And then I'm also going to be using my lot of body wrap me foaming mousse. Ladies, do y'all remember when we were on that live with Ariel? Hey girl, hey. Um, and we were talking about mousse and how we wanted to try mousse on some different hairstyles. Well, guess what? Today's the day. I'm going to be trying a twist and curl. Or maybe I should do a braid and curl. I think I'll do a braid and curl. A braid and curl with these two products, okay? I'm tired of these twist outs, y'all. I'm just tired of these plain, plain Jane twist outs. So I figured I'd spice it up a little bit and try something new. So today we will do a braid and curl using these products from the stash, trying to get rid of some stuff. And y'all, my empties are filling up, y'all. I'm getting through stuff, slowly but surely, getting through stuff. I'm having my boys kind of use up the stuff too. So we're getting through some stuff. So I'm gonna have a nice little empties video coming up somewhere soon in the near future but anyway let's get started with this video i don't want this to be too long plus i'm a little cold <laughs> it's a little chilly today um in georgia and i'm washing my hair and it's not making me feel any warmer so i want to go ahead and start you know to get my hair dry so let's get started all right y'all so i'm just about done with this moisture milk i know you can probably see this up here but it's not up there it's like really somewhere down here okay so i want to try to get this used up and as a matter of fact the pump is not even going to work i'm gonna have to take the pump out that's how low it is so and hopefully i can get this stuff out i probably should have turned it upside down So do y'all ever have to go through this? Trying to get the last of your product out? Do y'all do this or do y'all just throw away your, your product? Like, I'm not doing that over here. We don't throw away nothing over here. We use up the last drop. Um, yeah, so I'll be turning my stuff upside down, <laughs> letting it sit or whatever, just to make sure that I'm getting all my money's worth. So we'll just be banging a little bit today i'll try to edit it out where i can all right so i'm gonna use this curl styling milk as a um as a leave-in i was using this stuff like a lot a lot a lot when i first got it i really like this lot of body line this whole coconut and shea um, oils line it's a really really moisturizing line i went through the um the shampoo like super super quick yeah i went through the shampoo super quick i went through the shampoo faster than i went through the conditioner go figure that's how moisturizing that um shampoo was i really really enjoyed that shampoo now will i buy it again probably not anytime soon because i have so many other shampoos to try and and you know just to get through here in my stash so um yeah but if i was ever like on vacation or something like that somewhere and i just for whatever reason didn't have a shampoo i would be buying that shampoo if i saw it you know on the shelf that is a really good shampoo so we are just going to continue ah, i gotta shed it here y'all continue to apply this And I'm going to go in and, you know, 
spread a little bit more into like sections but i'm just trying to get it overall i'm trying to get it overall um coating of my, on my hair so All right, so let me go in now in a couple of sections and then I'll be right back and we can just start going in with the mousse and start to braid up, okay? So I'll be right back. All right, y'all, so I'm back. I finished putting the curl milk, curling style milk all over my hair and now we can just go right in with the mousse and I've got my perm rods here, the white ones, or the, the mini ones. So yeah, I'm gonna just go ahead and get started. So the curl milk actually has a little bit of holes, but um, I want to make sure the curls stay just in case. I think it's supposed to rain this week in Georgia, even though I don't go anywhere during the week. The humidity can be very, very high and it will just really upset my curls. So um, plus I'm going out tomorrow. I got a date, y'all. <laughs> Hubby's taking me on a date. So I want to look cute. You know what I'm saying? I want the hairstyle to last. So I'm going to go in with some of this mousse here. Probably just going to need one pump is good enough for me y'all know i have fine hair strands so i never really need that much product anyway so i'm gonna go in with this and y'all i've never done a braid out with mousse before so this is going to be very interesting to see how this is going to hold up i think i can use another pump one more pump So I'm really, I want to see how mousse works. Like I never really use mousse. I buy it, you know, to do like, um, I've always had the intention to do perm rod sets, but never really done them. Hopefully this year I can try it. <laughs> super, super nervous to try it, but because um, I know it's just going to take a long time to do. You know what I mean? Um, so, but we'll get to it. But that was the reason why I bought the mousses in the first place. So I might as well attempt to use them on other styles as well, right? Even wash and goes. I've heard, I've seen girls do um, wash and goes with the mousse too. So we'll try that too this year. Y'all give me some recommendations on some mousses. I already have, um, well, y'all know I got this one. I have the Mayel mousse. Um... Who else? Do I, I have the Moose Def by The Do. And I want to say that's it. I don't really have too many mousses. So what are some good mousses? Let me know. And what are some hairstyles that I should try using mousse? Let me know. So we can, we can try it out here on the channel. Alright y'all. So this is feeling good. I don't feel like I'm gonna like have any flakage or anything like that the way that this is going on to the hair so we should be good and my hair felt good to begin with I had a really good base I don't know if I mentioned that earlier I can't remember but um, <clears throat> I had a really really good deep conditioning session and you know, my hair just feels so good after that feels good and it looks good all right, so look at how long my hair is, y'all. All right, so we're gonna do the curl now, the curl part of this. And I'm gonna take it up to about right there. Try again. I'm gonna take it up to about right there. like that so I'm gonna do the next side I'm gonna play some music for y'all probably speed this up and I'll be back when I'm done you special and she reckless and babe you're my bestest friend yeah she my bestie my love for you is endless nobody else can end it 
And when I get the money back, then baby girl, you can spend it. Uh -huh. And everything is alright. I like how you're doing alright, alright. Like how you think alright. Always on top of you. She bad, but I don't bad. She a gun shot that blew my mind. No distance, I come by my side. Everything is green over here. Oh, yeah. Everything you want and think about. Now I got your back all the way. And everything is alright. I like how you're doing alright, alright. Like how you think alright. Always on top of you. All right, y'all, so your girl is all done. Finished with the braids, finished with the perm rods. This is what we looking like. Okay, and y'all, I am freezing, freezing, okay? I don't know what's up with this Georgia weather. I mean, it is cold today. The, the wind was whipping around outside. I wanted to go outside in my garden and like start getting my garden ready for the spring. And I couldn't even go out there because the wind was just whipping like, just whipping, just whipping around. Whip it good. So um, needless to say, I didn't go out there today. I've been in the house all day. But then still, it's kind of a cold day to be like washing my hair. So I think I'm going to sit under the hair dryer for just a few to kind of get my head, my head dry. Because initially I was going to air dry, but I'm cold. So I'm going to give me some hot chocolate. I'm going to wrap up. <laughs> and I'm going to sit under the hair dryer, try to get myself warm. Tell hubby to kick on the heat just a little bit. Y'all know men love it cold in the house. So he is absolutely loving this temperature i want to say it's like 65 degrees in this house y'all but i'm freezing so he gonna have to turn that heat up okay something i, I can't do it i'm cold and i got a wet head mm -mm. no sir so yeah i'm about to go do that and um go chill with my fur babies and probably edit some videos and watch some of y'all's videos so i will be back tomorrow for the takedown so we can see how this braid and curl turns out Hopefully these curls won't be too, too small. I mean, I haven't really experimented with perm rods in a really, really long time. I do have all different sizes of them. So I just figured I'd start off with these small ones this time. And then next time, you know, we may graduate to the bigger size if I don't like the way the curls look. So anyway, I will see y'all tomorrow. All right, you guys, so it's the next day and it's time for the takedown. My hair is completely dried and I did wind up air drying. I just had help you put the heat on and I have some hot chocolate and I have my little, um, like I have this little dress that I bought from Walmart. Just a cute little dress just to kind of be around the house in and it had a hood. So I was able to put the hood on and I was cool. So I wound up air drying. So let's see how this um, turns out. That's a nice curl right there. Now I haven't used these perm rods in a really long time. I used to put them on the ends of my hair like up in a ponytail and just rock that for like the week. Back when I used to use um, Curl A La. Who remembers when I used to use Curl A La? And I love that stuff. And I actually have a little jar of it in my stash. Because I loved it so much back then when I was in. I used to use it when I was relaxed. Um, but I don't think I really used it on my natural hair. So I wanted to try it. And I had picked it up a while ago. I want to say maybe last year I picked it up. But I just never got a chance to use it. So I may pull that out this summer. Because it's a really light, light product. And it really does well. But anyway, back to a lot of body. <laughs> All right, so everything feels nice and soft. 
I mean, there is sort of a stiffness to this these curls here, but um, it doesn't feel like crazy hard or anything, so. I'm just gonna take just a little bit of my oil just so I don't get that much frizz because I know I'm gonna get frizz, but um, just to kind of keep the frizz down. And then the thing about braid outs is that they just take forever to undo. I love the definition, but the takedown, yeah, it's forever. Might have to bust out my little rat tail comb. Look at those curls are super pretty, y'all. I'm gonna have to do some kind of flexi rod or perm rod set this year. Oh, I love the, how those curls look. Mm -hmm. Let me get so lazy as naturals. Wash and goes and just twist outs and just keep it moving. Sometimes we forget that we need to do some other things to get be a little cute. All right, y'all, so this is how it's looking. I think this is gonna turn out really pretty. Let me go ahead and take out the rest. I'm gonna get that rat tail comb though. All right, y'all, so here is the final look. I think this is absolutely the cutest little style ever. I think this might be my new go-to style, but I do wanna try it as a twist out because taking out these braids, y'all, Mm -mm. no fun at all takes forever to take down braid outs y'all even though like I said I love the definition that it gives but it's just time consuming but let me turn around to the back I tried to pick this out as much as I could to try to get the part out but as y'all can see it's very very like fluffy it's definitely soft I feel like it's a little shiny too um no contribution to the oil because i really only use the oil for the ends which i'm so glad i did because there was a little bit of a you know how mousse gives you that hold and so if i didn't use the oil on the ends i would have gotten a way more frizz than i already did as you can see there's just a little bit of frizz but there would have been way more frizz if i didn't use the oil but anyway y'all super super cute like i said before in the beginning i really love this lot of body line it really never fails i mean i feel like it's like a a go-to cheap line like if you need something that's inexpensive but something that's gonna work i like this lot of body and that curl and style milk and that mousse like those are in the shampoo for me those are the bangers in that whole line i don't know about too many of the other products although I do have the edge control and I, I do kind of like the edge control but I have another edge control that's like my favorite that's not my go-to edge control but that edge control is pretty good too but yeah the the curling style milk the mousse and the shampoo even though I didn't use the shampoo today are like my favorites out of this whole line so y'all let me know what y'all think about my style I don't want to be putting my hands in it too much because I'm gonna know I'm gonna mess it up but yeah you guys let me know what you think how it came out right so have you used these lot of body products what are your thoughts what are your thoughts on them um again i'm trying to use up the stash so uh i'll be probably using this again probably to maybe to do the same thing but in a twist out you know a twist and curl or maybe we'll try some other styles y'all i just forgot just how much i like curls on the ends of my hair and how it how it changes a style you know how much it can change your style so i might start you know doing the perm rod just a little bit more or some other kind of curlers 
in the near future here before it gets a little bit too hot because y'all know this georgia weather do not be playing <laughs> with nobody but um while it's you know kind of warming up and still just a little cool out here i may try to experiment a little bit more so anyway i'm gonna go y'all unfortunately the date has been canceled the place where we're gonna go to opens up a little bit later than we thought in the day and we already have plans for the evening part of the day so the date got canceled but we're still headed out to go run a few errands so i'll just be looking cute running errands today <laughs> but anyway you guys i want to thank you so much for watching i love and appreciate you all and i will see y'all in my next video bye bye now